Hey guys, welcome back. Today's video is going to be about skull crushers and whether I think they are a good tricep exercise or not. Part of that depends on safety, um, weight you're using, kind of male or female, although women are quite strong too, but whether or not it's a good and effective exercise or if there's better alternatives. So uh, let's get started. All right, so I'm going to use a small barbell. You could have a big barbell or a small one, whatever you have handy. But on this one, I'm going to lean back. I could keep my feet on the floor or my feet up, whichever is more comfortable. Now there's two main ways of doing skull crushers. With my elbows up, I can bring the barbell towards my head or skull, like a skull crusher, or aim my elbows back, come from behind my head, and then extend outwardly without the swing, just like this. So once again, elbows up, come towards my head, trying not to smack myself in the head or arms back and do a tricep extension like this. All right, so that was a skull crusher. So once again, it, for me, it's kind of the jury's out. I like to add skull crusher in there, uh, not as the main exercise for me. That way I don't have to go as heavy. Therefore, it's a little bit safer. It does hit the tricep quite well, so it is a beneficial exercise. But there are safety concerns, like I said, when you go too heavy. Um, so once again, it wouldn't be my major exercise. It will be one that I use after I pre-fatigue the muscles. But give it a shot, see what you think. And uh, don't forget, use good form. Thumbs up, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.